It's time for the confluence of two great things in Japan, spring break and sakura. We've got lots of fun things lined up for this break, and it all culminates in grand sakura fashion. Get ready to see Japan's sakura spring break on this Life in Japan. There are many great places to see sakura in the Tokyo area, but the tickets are limited and many places like Ueno are all sold out. Not to fear, we got tickets for Shinjuku Park and are going there to meet up with a new friend and check it out. That's a weird tree over there. Look at Anna posing the boys. Oh my goodness. Oh. <laughs> nice. Anna's getting some shots over here. So today, we have Dr. Justin with us. Hi guys! Tell me, you have a YouTube channel? Yeah, I have a YouTube channel, Dr. Justin in Japan. And I do videos about Okinawa in southern Japan. I swim with fish and also do research on mental health and Japan. I love joining your family today. This is so oh, exciting. Well, it's so fun to have you with us. Thank Thanks you. for joining us. Let's do this. <laughs> Let's do this. It doesn't look like Okinawa, but it's still fun. <laughs> <laughs> what is happening here? <laughs> there we go. With the introductions done, it was time to explore the park. Even though the skies were gray, the park was full of beautiful sakura trees of all types in bloom. It was one beautiful landscape after another, but it comes at a price. Because if you visit Shinjuku Park with kids, beware. There's no playgrounds to entertain the kids, and even playing in the fields is prohibited, except in one designated area. But if beautiful scenes are your thing, you'll find it at Shinjuku Park. These are two very, very famous things in Okinawa. These are from the ocean. They're really sweet and tasty. Oh, is he great? Eat them just like that. And then this is the famous uh, dessert there you guys can try. So these are very Okinawan style. Cool, well thank you. And with a fun souvenir in hand, the kids let us know it was time to head home. You getting a free ride, dude? Yeah? He hurt his feet. Oh, wow. But he has a walking stick. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> For me, there's nothing quite like Sakura. But at night, in the neighborhoods around where we live, it becomes something magical that words just can't quite describe. The next day we piled into our car and made our way into the mountains. Ruth's friend Yoshiko invited us out to Odakyu Forest on Lake Yamanaka for a night in a cabin. So we temporarily left the Sakura behind for an adventure near Mount Fuji. Whether we would actually see Mount Fuji or not was still a bit dubious. There we go, we see the cabin in the woods, our place for tonight. Let's see, what do we have here? Oh no, we can't stay inside. We'll have to stay out on the porch, huh? Yeah. Who says to sleep out here, huh? Don't break it. I did it. Yeah! She did it! It's just like the school one. Oh, is it? Okay, let's see. What do we have, guys? This is it. I claim this corner. I claim the corner. Everybody sleeps right here. 
Okay, should we bring our stuff up? Oh, you did. Okay, everyone, super quiet. Look what do you see out there? There's deer. Do you see it out there? Oh my goodness. How awesome is that? I know, it is kind of like America, huh? Can you get a shot of it, do you think? Oh my goodness, how crazy. Wow, so cool. After getting settled in, we did a quick trip to the grocery store before it was time for the main event of the night. Whoa, do we need a flashlight on so we can see? Ooh. Ooh, look at this. Glory be. Tonight it's barbecue. <laughs> we said a prayer of thanks together and then the feast began. No one would go hungry tonight. Okay, time to eat. Mm. Mm. Oh. After dinner, there was another surprise waiting. Okay. <laughs> hey, what's going on? <laughs> oh, here we go, huh, Sarah? Is it finally bedtime, honey? No. Yes? No, I don't. Joshua's bed is all ready? I don't want to go in there because I'm not tired. You're not tired yet? One minute later, I'm he's asleep. In our yes, you are. You are ready for bed, Fred. Here we go. There's nothing like getting out early. You gotta get those early morning shots. <laughs> That's the way you gotta do it. Well, yesterday, the clouds came down just to this point and you couldn't see anything above it. But today, it is exactly the opposite. <laughs> the clouds are just hovering over the lake now and you can see everything above it but when I was down in there you couldn't see anything at all we're staying just over here all right that's beautiful time to get back deliver some coffee to the crew Japanese cabins is kind of just like one big huge sleepover and the whole room just transforms into just keep massive bed. <laughs> you heard daddy snore. I didn't. You didn't? I heard daddy sleep talking. How about that? You didn't make a sleep all night. Whoa, Becca. He was asleep the whole time and I woke up <laughs> so now the sleepover is over. We got to get everything just all pulled up and put back so we can head on. Yeah. Look, okay, let's be quiet, everybody, okay? You guys see him? The baby one is looking our way. There he goes. There he goes. Extra time. Get your pictures. There's three more coming over here. Yeah, I see them. Did you get your shot, Sarah? No. You did? It's too bright. <laughs> it's too bright. Can I go right down the house? Yeah, go, go, go. Can I take my phone and take a picture? Yeah, this is a good place to take pictures. Sarah, did you get a picture? Yeah. You gonna send it to me? Yeah, wait, wait, wait. Yeah? I have a little photographer at work for me here. 
Very nice. Did you get a picture too, Anna? Uh -huh. On a scale of one to ten, what do you think it is? A nine. A nine? Wow! <laughs> On our way home, we stopped at one of our favorite parks near Mount Fuji, Sakura Park in Gotemba. Since the elevation is lower than Lake Yamanaka, these sakura are just about to bloom, as opposed to sakura down near sea level where we live, which have already bloomed. It's fun to have so many different climates near us. Oh, yes. You guys ready? After getting our fill of sliding in, it was time to head back home. Joshua had a special appointment he did not want to miss. What is going on today? Aiden's gonna come to my house. Aiden's gonna come to your house? Well, eight hours. Eight hours? You can go to Aiden. Oh my goodness, what do you guys think? Are you ready for a big day today? Yeah. What are you gonna do first, do you think? We're going to go to the coffee shop first. I have my mom's group and the boys are having their meeting. <laughs> Oh, I get this one. No, I mean, I think blue. No, I think blue. Yeah, I like blue. I like blue. But the ultimate sakura experience involves getting a bento, a prepared lunch you can either make or buy, and taking it out with friends to have a picnic under the sakura. The Japanese call this hanami, or blossom viewing, and it is the best way to enjoy the sakura. Maybe you want to eat? Oh yes, that looks great. With the sakura, huh? Yeah. Now the sakura doesn't go on our food. It's a sakura picnic time. Oh yes, oh yes, oh yes, oh yes. <laughs> What started off as a cold and cloudy day gave way to beautiful blue skies and warm sunlight as we enjoyed spring break in just the right fashion. Oh, good job, dude! Oh, yeah! Oh, what? pretty dynamite, huh? Beautiful day. Yeah, just remember, you gotta look at the lens and not the screen. You can't. Yeah. <laughs> you can't <laughs> and that was our Sakura Spring Break this year. If you like these videos, please take a moment to comment and subscribe. And until next time, we'll see you on Life in Japan. Bye bye.